Uh, it was third down, a uh, tight game. Um, I just knew, you know, the ball could be coming to me and I have to make the play if it does. So um, that was it. I ran my route, ball came. I just knew I had to make the play. There was no, you know, there was no other option. So, so do you, you don't know this? I mean, you don't have a good feeling coming to you based on the situation? Uh, I mean, every time I run a route, I hope it's coming to me. So, um, <laughs> Every play, I don't know, you know, you just got to expect expect it to come. You know, uh, you got to be ready at all times. So, um, but especially, you know, on like third down plays, you know, I'm like, this is this is the last play of the possession potentially. So um, regardless, everybody has to be ready and prepared you know, for the opportunity. What did it say about Jordan coming to you? Because you've had a couple of plays that you wanted back in that game for him to come to you in that moment and believe in you. And I don't know how much of that helped you believe in yourself, that even after not a great game by your standards to make a play like that, um, yeah, that just goes off, you know, um, the relationship that we've built um, over the year. Uh, at the end of the day, you know, it's a long game. It's a dog fight, 60 minutes. Um, he just kept on preaching, you know, next play. We still got a long game to go. And um, it gets frustrating sometimes, you know, when you, you feel like you're not doing the best you could. But um, like you said, you know, it is a long game. I understand that's a long game. Uh, it's a next play mentality. Every play is its own play. So um, just having that mentality, you know, just helps you just stay focused on you know, that one play and just doing your assignment. And um, that's the thing about not just Jordan, but everyone on this team, you know, everyone brings each other up. Um, everyone helps each other. Everyone wants to, everyone wants each other to do their best. So um, just great support all around on the team. A lot, a lot of teams, a lot of teams have different things about football teams are How important is um, this? For the team, you know, um, it's been a couple of years, I think, since they've been to a bowl game. Uh, me last year, uh, my old school, we made it to a bowl game, but I didn't play in it. So this is my first experience at bowl game. So it's big for me. And, uh, you know, we just keep on talking about, you know, that 10 win season. And, uh, you know, I don't care who we play. I didn't care who we played. I just want I just want that last win, you know, on the season. So um, I'm excited. I know the team's excited, you know, go out there and uh, put on a show. I know a lot of people are excited about what you guys could be next year, but can you look back and describe just how different life is for you right now one year ago from where you were to where you're at now and just your, your belief in yourself and just everything on and off. Yeah, I mean, um, last year I didn't even I didn't even get to make it past week four uh, before my season was, you know, cut short. So um, I'm just blessed, you know, honestly, I just feel so grateful to just, you know, have this opportunity every day, you know, to just come out here and play the game that I love. Uh, sometimes you can take it for granted. Uh, days are some days are hard, you know, some days you feel like you don't feel like being out there. But um, it's like when you you lose it all, you know, when you really can't play it, you can't play football. It's like you finally get the opportunity again. And it just makes you look at it from a whole different perspective. Um, you know, it just just feels great to be out here again uh, compared to last year. I did it. You know, I didn't I didn't even expect me to be in this situation that I'm in now. So uh, I'm just thankful. Can, can you think about just how much more better position you'll be next year with, with the confidence you have now versus how great you played this year, but maybe you didn't have that kind of confidence with mm -hmm. yourself leading into it? Um, I've always believed in my my abilities. Um, you know, I just feel like um, we just got to take it one day at a time, you know, one game at a time. Uh, we got this last game coming up and, you know, I'm just, I'm not even looking, you know, to next year yet. You know, we still got this last game. Um, so, yeah, that's where my mind's at. Uh, I'm not looking past nowhere, but, you know, December 29th. So. You touched on that excitement. Keen came when they talked about when change the size and the locker room was a big part of that. Does that make it easier for this team to, to be locked in through full practice? Do you see that? Yeah, I mean, definitely. Um, dudes, you know, they, they want to leave a legacy. You know, they want to make an impact, you know, on this program, on this team. And, uh, you know, for all the dudes that are coming back and playing in this bowl game, um, you know, that shows a lot about this team, about, you know, the brotherhood that we've built. Um, there's a lot of dudes that, you know, could go, you know, pursue their dreams at the next level or, you know, do what they want to do. But at the end of the day, you know, they all want to come together and get this win together. You know, we've brought, we brought, you know, so much excitement and so much togetherness to this team, you know, to, uh, as a whole. So, I mean, everyone just wants to go get this last win together. You've had a lot of position coaches throughout your life. What's um, coaches like how to Uh, Coach Dugan's, you know, he's, it's like, it's like tough love. 
it's tough love and you know he just wants you to be your best uh, all the time uh, you know no matter what it is he never wants to sell you short you know whatever you think you can't do he's going to tell you, you can do times 10. Um, when you feel like you don't believe in yourself he's always going to believe in you he's always going to push you and you know for me it's like just having him in you know our corner in our room uh, just pushing each other you know pushing everyone to be their best and you know uh, he's just been great great coach Johnny, how are you kind of approaching the decision process for after this season um i haven't i haven't even put much thought into it um Honestly, you know, everyone's just focused on this next, you know, this next game, this next win. Uh, I have no clue, you know, what God has in store for me yet. So um, I'm just taking it one, you know, one day at a time, one step at a time, one game at a time. So I um, just want to go get this last win. You guys have your itinerary? Are you guys going to go to Disney World? Have you ever been to Disney World? I went to Disney World uh, a couple weeks ago with my girlfriend. So uh, it was fun. It was fun. But uh, I think we were on Universal. So I haven't been there yet. Thanks, Johnny. All right. Thank you, guys.